Okay, let's get at it. Good morning. It is November 8th, 2021. Day 160. Another 30 degree night for us. And another dry morning. And so we are making our way. We just left our uh, stealth site from last night. It was a good spot. And shared some dinner with uh, another hiker who we uh, just recently met. So all was good last night. Um, today, it should be a nice day all day um, before it gets cold again tonight. Um, but we've got uh, something like 16 and a half miles or so. And the start of the day is about six miles of uppy downies going across Walnut Mountain. And then we've got a big drop down into a valley again where there's another waterfall, supposedly. And then a big climb out of that valley up Buck Mountain. And then the rest of the afternoon, I think, uh, coast down and we're gonna get out of the cold again tonight and hit Mountain View Hostel something along those lines we're gonna take advantage of the hostels in the cold weather oh there's the sun peeking up over the uh, ridge line over there that's uh southern Virginia has and into Tennessee, there have been a lot more hostels. And we've decided we are going to take advantage of them when they make sense. So, not in view tonight. And then we've got about five days before our next one. And I think that should cover it. Like I said, yeah, the sun is looking good. Once that peaks up over the ridge, I bet we're going to warm up a bit. Okay. See you out there. Okay, we are checking out Hardcore Cascades, which isn't even one of the two waterfalls we're supposed to be passing today. So this is just a bonus uh, cascade for us. I'm going down. Not bad. Jump! Okay, we are still apparently around Laurel Fork. And lots of little cascades and running water here. Now we're still not at our two big waterfalls. So well, apparently today is the water day. All right, these are Mountaineer Falls, the first of our two waterfalls. It's kind of cool. Not a ton of water, but it's still a uh, cool fall off the rock. And flowing down here across our trail. Okay, been hanging out at a uh, little campsite here, um, having some lunch. Good stuff. Do we have to keep moving? We do. Seven miles to go. Seven miles to go. Today. Today. But then we get a bed. See ya. Okay. 
approaching Jones Falls on a Blue Blaze side trail. And so far it looks like it's much more impressive than Mountaineering Falls or the last one that we came to. Let's see what we uh, get. I don't think it's much further. Yep, that's a pretty nice falls. There's the sun just peeking through the trees right there, right next to the falls. That's pretty cool. I like this one. We are approaching our end of day. Probably have about a mile and a half to go before we get to the hostel where we're staying tonight. The day has turned out beautiful. It's sunny and warm and great views where we've got them. Still some color in the trees. We will take it. All right, it's end of day 160. Um, so uh, another good day hiking. Um, we did 16.6 miles, I think. Mm -hmm. Um, maybe 16.8 if we count the road walk road to the, uh, to the, the hostel, hostel at the end. Um, so we left our uh, stealth site over by a couple streams. Um, had some dinner last night with uh, um, Frogger. With Frogger, one of the uh, so other hikers. Just met, yeah. Yep. So uh, that was kind of fun. And uh, um, we had a lot of climbing yesterday. Um, up but it was and down and then up day. again. It was but it was really a, warm. We saw a lot of waterfalls, yep, Arc Court Falls, and Mountaineer Falls, waterfalls. and Jones Falls, and that was really kind of neat. Yep, yep. So I think the waterfalls were probably the highlight of the, uh, of the and day. The and the warm weather. We were down yeah. to our, our regular shirts and no sweatshirts for the first time, for me at least, in quite a while. Yep. And it, it, it's funny because it started out fully uh, bundled Cold. up again. <laughs> <laughs> so. so we'll see. Uh, but uh, yeah, um, Mountain Harbor Hostel, a nice place. Uh, mm -hmm. um, Breakfast Good resupply. And all yep. of that stuff. So, uh, no complaints. not bad. Okay. And uh, that's about it for me. Yeah, we didn't see very many people again. I think that was kind of an interesting thing. Yep. Um, and I do have a highlight. Um, we were in the store at Mountain Harbor resupplying, and a wonderful gentleman named Dave came in and was just chatting with us. And Frogger happened to be there too. He stayed at the hostel, uh, staying at the hostel as well. And Dave whipped out his credit card and bought the resupply for all three of us yeah. and and we were like hey are you sure man there's two of us yeah, and he's like no this is what we do. do we don't need to do this <laughs> but, uh, he said we're retired we want to pay it forward they apparently do a lot of trail magic down in georgia where they live um, yeah. and they maintain a mile on the trail so we'll look out for that mile when we're down there yeah. um, and just that that was really generous thank you <laughs> and yes. uh and unexpected I, trail magic which yeah, was kind of nice it sure was it was okay thank you and, and we'll see you tomorrow see you tomorrow